Jerusalem. This is Grant Bowe reporting live from WGOD, and I just came in from a soccer game, literally just landed momentary, moments ago. We're here to meet the son of Amos. His name, Isaiah. Now, his name uh, literally means the Lord saves. This man is considered the prince of the prophets, and we're here hoping to hear his story. Now, it's hard to describe it to you. I'm anxious for us to meet him, hopefully. Apparently, he had a vision, but not just any vision, the vision, where God came to him, God spoke to him, and told him about his world, told him about the kingdom and the end. So let's hopefully go down here, see him, and see what this message is about, maybe hear this vision. Let's come on down, let's see how we do. Actually, I'm a little embarrassed by my appearance, but at the same time, I'm so excited I couldn't turn this opportunity down here. Let's, let's see here, there's a fella here. Let's see. Here am I, send me. Oh my, oh my. Excuse me, uh, are you Isaiah? Here am I, send me. S send you, send you where? Do you not know? Have you not heard that the God is the everlasting God? The creators of the ends of the earth? Where he sends me, I will go. So you're, you okay? What, where, where are we going? What, what's the message? Wherever he sends me, I will go. Cowboy, you, you okay? You seem a little bothered here. I saw the Lord. He was sitting on a throne, high and exalted. Just the train of his robe filled the place with heaven. And, and the angels were surrounded by him. They kept singing, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord Almighty. The earth is filled with his glory. Just the sound of the voices made the doorpost shake. Then the room was filled with smoke. Giddy. Uh, oh, oh, what next? I cried. You, you cried. You met the Lord and you cried. Why would you cry? You had an opportunity to be with the Lord. Unless you were me. I was a man with unclean lips, surrounded by a bunch of other people with unclean lips. I am in deep trouble. I have seen the King, the Lord Almighty. Okay, okay. Well, let's let's get back. What what did you see? Keep, keep going. So there I was in trouble, when suddenly an angel came out of nowhere with a hot red coal. Then he touched the coal to my lips and made me a promise. He said that my guilt was gone because a coal had touched my lips. I could not believe it. My guilt was gone. I had been healed. Then I heard the God's voice saying something. Okay, what, what did he say? What did God say? He said, Whom shall I send? And who will go for us? So, so who do you think will go? Who will go deliver this message? Here am I. Send me. Isaiah, is it you? Will you take the message for God? Here am I. Send me. No. I think it might be you. You might be the one. Folks, let me ask you. Are you going to be like my friend Isaiah? Will you be the one who will deliver the message if God calls on you? Will you hear Him? Will you spread His Word and His Gospel? I think you can if you try hard enough. This is Grant Bolt reporting live from Jerusalem. And remember, wherever you go, there you are. Back to you at headquarters. Tell me more, just anything about what you saw, how you feel. Here am I, send me.